Okay, what's up, you want this Asian K? Yeah, playing uh, Grand Theft Auto San Andreas Time Mission. So they get a few missions made by uh, Jimmy Light Park. And the title mission is Vengeful Spirit Part 2, which is his uh, 18th mission of uh, his uh, Sweep Squad series. So, yeah, we're wasting for our time, we're gonna like this mission and start things for now. Los Santos Cemetery, about 10 minutes later. Hey, why are we here, man? This kind of freaks me out. We're here because Nate told me about your plan to go after Galachir. What is that? Uh, I already told Foil why. I don't want to run and hide after he comes back. And I want to make him pay for all that shit he made us to go through for him. That's great. Now how about you guys give me the real reason? Those are the real reason. No, they're not. I see right through you. You know why? You and I are more familiar than you know. I once did the same shit you want to do now. I had a few fuck it up people that after me who were gonna let me live no matter what. They were doing anything they could to flush me out and kill me. Even going after the people I love, it. I just wanted, wasn't get to go at that point. I was too prideful. I thought running away would be a cowardly thing to do. I wanted to face him, show them that we were messing with and make them regret it. I knew killing them all will ensure safety for me and everyone I care about. And I was so confident that me and my team could do it and live in peace afterwards. And I was right, we did it. We wiped them all out, but I had it had a price. Here li lies Thomas Jenkins. That right there he was my best friend, one of my members of my back my team back then. He always had my back on everything. He took me in when I got out of prison. He was the first one to back me up when I said we should kill all those bastards. And thanks to him, I'm back together with only one, the only woman I ever love. And for that last thing, he managed to accomplish it after he died. Sadly enough, he had to die for that to happen in the first place. Oh shit, he did all these things those things for me and now he's dead I didn't even get the chance to pay him back for any of it and why is dead because he followed me in my plans to kill everyone who wasn't letting us have our peace we wanted to leave Los Santos when shit hit the fan but I said no I said we can kill them all and live here in peace and we, he believed in me if I agree with his plan, he'll still be alive today. That's why I had to finish it all. I had to avenge him. I feel responsible for his death and I thought that. By killing everyone who were after us will make me feel better or that I will somehow redeem myself for his death by doing that. But I was wrong. Killing all those batters didn't bring him back. I could have gotten killed it or the rest of my team because we, they went with me. Luckily, we all survived it. We got our peace. But it sure hell is a bittersweet one. So I ask you again because it's, if it's true that you really want to go after Galacher just because you like this city too much and live be, and because you wanna kill Galactrick to show him who's boss even though you and your team already won. And you just want to put yourself and your team in more danger because of nothing. Then I'm gonna have to go tell Nate that I was really wrong about you guys. So again, why do you want to go after Galactrick so much after these circumstances? All right, you got me. There's a different reason why I want to go after him. I didn't even tell it to my crew cause 
I haven't really felt this way before. But the real reason why I want to kill Galatra is because he kills your brother. I know all of that happening is because of him. Me. And it's not so much about me screwing up, but about what happened as a result of it. Donnie died because of me. If I said that to my crew, they will say shit like Donnie died because of himself or Lance or Gallagher. But the fact is he dies because of me. They won't, they won't get it, but I know it's true. Donnie and I were good friends before that job I screwed up 10 days ago. And the reason why he did what, what is because he was angry with me getting us into trouble for absolutely no reason at all. And I don't want to blame him that much because again, because it was my fault from the start. I cannot turn back time to undo what I done, which lead to his death. So killing Galatry is what will give me my own peace at my own at this point. Because while I am the one who indirectly responsible for Donnie's death, Galatry is the one who paid Lance to kill Donnie. He wanted Donnie dead. I didn't. So killing Galatry will ultimately be my apologize to Donnie. I have to do it. And I'm sorry if that does point you or father or whatever, but I'm gonna go ahead, do it for him. Your first answer disappointed me, but this one didn't because it's the truth. And that's what I wanted to hear from you. You remind me of my, myself a lot, kid, and that's the biggest compliment I can give you. I didn't come to try to change your mind. They'd ask me to do that, though. But I know that determined man when I see one. The reason why I came to you today is because I wanted to see if your determination is focused correctly, and it's sure as hell it is. I really would like to see anything happen to you guys. But I'm not going to try to stop you because you guys are men on a mission right now. And I don't know what your plan for Galatry is, but you better give him hell. And if you guys survive, we'll talk, alright? Ugh, sure. About what? Just survive. Let's go. I'll take you home. Sometimes later in Nate's house. Yeah, that was a long conversation, man. Duck, duck. And did you talk some sense into him? Yep. So he'll, he'll stop going after Gallagher? No. What? Hmm. Wait. So that means time for graduation, I guess. To be continued, which means that's pretty much the animation. Stay tuned, I'm going to play our mission very soon. Alright, uh, thanks for being a mission made by Jimmy and part. And the talent mission, it's. The Triumphant Part 1, which is his, uh, let's see, 19 mission of uh, his, uh, of his uh, Sweep Squad series. So, yeah, we're always in for a time with our guess mission. He's stopping to now. JT's house the following evening. Right after Scott dropped me back to JT's house, we call. Ross to join us so we could start thinking of plans to kill Gallagher. We had a plan in place by the following evening. Then the last piece of puzzle buzzing in the long awaited phone call. <coughs> Ring, this is it. Finally ready? Yup. Hello. Y'all dead. Dead. 
Oh, Mr. Gallagher, nice to hear from you too, sir. Haha. <laughs> How was your business trip to Vice City? Good. Got home safe. Haha. <laughs> you punk son of a bitch put the last nail in your coffins by killing Jones and taking that diamond. I thought I was dreaming when I heard it just now. Oh no, you're not dreaming. This is real life, asshole. And the worst is coming. Did you forget who you're talking to, boy? Nah, I could never forget an asshole like you. Every one of my men is after you punks. You got no place to hide. Shut your mouth, my mouth, bitch. You're not your boss anymore. We ain't hiding, but you should. You got the nerve to make empty threats over the phone now. But I assure you, you'll be on your knees begging for mercy by sunrise. I think you're looking for a wrong schedule because on my schedule by sunrise, you'll be the one who will be dead. I will see. If I were you, I'll make peace with everything you got in your little punk lives. Sorry, we cannot hear from you from the sound of all the money that's about to be wired on your our accounts by selling diamond. You sold the diamond? Oh, you just lost your last bargaining chip, punk. I'll enjoy killing you the most. Alright. Did you get it? Yep, Galatra is in his fancy club in Rodeo, as expected. Awesome, Ross, you already put all the stuff we need in my car, right? Yep, we're good to go, homie. Alright, Dad, get ready. We're leaving in a few minutes. Time to put our plan into action and get this shit over with once and for all. At the same time, Dollar Tree's club in Rodeo. My goodness, why? Mr. Gallagher, you call? How long would, until our field units take Bridgedale's punk's house? They already check it out Hendrix's house. They're not there. Alright guys, we'll get to, to the other two houses in a couple of minutes, sir. Hendrix said they're not hiding. That means they must be at the one of their house. Tell our guys I want this punk country alive at all costs. Now get out of here. In the meantime, at JT's house. Are you guys ready to go? <coughs> what was that? Fuck, I think the, those are Galatra's people. Get on the back, we're gonna get the guns and take them out. Go, go! They're coming, get ready! Oh shit, I don't know how powerful they are. Kill all the. Oh my, guess why I have an MP5? What's, what happened with my AK-57? Or M4? Go, come on, come on, come on, come on. It's gonna be hard. I feel a lot more pressure with the time limit. I'm dead. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, it's hard. Uh, thing is that uh, there's also my allies, which kind of annoys me. So I have to do something about it. Like, maybe hiding near the wall would be a best idea for me. Uh, yeah, let's try to do this. Well, I don't know which wall, but uh, I need to find a place where I can cover myself easily so yeah great bad guys all right ready for round two stay here guys let me take care of oh shit man that's why i don't like playing with allies man what you look at this is a good place to to protect myself here. Seriously, I'm not kidding here. 
You know who I am, don't you? No, not really. But at least it's effective. Despite, you know, all the shots. Done. They're not really attacking my lives. Like Yo, I cannot reach, it's too far, man. This is still alive, he's staying there, it's okay. I don't mind. Fuck. Yo, where do I have to go? Alright, we're good. Now, the next and final stop, Galactus Club, fellas. We should be there before they even find out what happened back there. I don't think I've even been as pumped about something as I am about this shit. I've been waiting to kill that son of a bitch ever since we got into his trouble. It's been a long ass wait, and finally, finally it's here after so long. Long ass wait, nigga. We, you've been waiting for 10 days, not 10 years. Motherfucker, it feels like 10 years, alright? Yeah, I feel you, homie. And the fact that Galatry doesn't even know we are coming makes him this even sweeter. I just hope that none of us get killed once this shit starts. I ain't ready to go. Hey, none of us is gonna die. We stick to the plan, everything will be fine. Yeah, okay, homie. To be continued, which means that's pretty much the end of the mission. Thank you for watching, and see you next time, guys.